It stood more than a metre and a half tall. It weighed around 200 kilos. It had a beak, no teeth, claws and feathers all over. Say hello to the world's newest dinosaur. Imagine a creature that is sort of a cross between an emu or better a cassowary because it has a similar crest on the head and an alligator. So a bizarre looking creature covered in feathers, long tail, this head with this tall, tall crest on it, a big large beak in front, large eyes, and then long arms and long legs, and the, the uh, arms ending in hands with these enormous claws. The bird-like dino walked the earth around the end of the Cretaceous period. That makes it around 68 million years old. Fragments of the skeleton were found in the rock layer in the Dakotas known as the Hell Creek Formation, giving the discovery the nickname, the Chicken from Hell. Over three sites, the scientists found little bits of bone, and they managed to put it all together to create 80% of a skeleton, and that gave them an idea of what this dinosaur may have looked like. The scientific name for the new creature is Anzu Wiley. It probably ate vegetation and passing prey, and the dinosaur hunters can't hide their excitement at the discovery. Almost every time you find a new dinosaur, it seems to represent something different, something really new and different, and every once in a while you find something that is just completely out of sight, you know, it's just a creature like this or certain other dinosaurs that have been described in recent years where you go and think like, this is really some sort of weird thing that evolution <laughs> cooked up here, you know. The discovery of this bird-like creature once again establishes a link between dinosaurs and birds, another piece in the jigsaw of the evolutionary chain. Alan Fisher, Al Jazeera, Washington.